Lots of you have been following along as I read and research a set of diaries from the 1940s. And from the very beginning, I've been searching for relatives, descendants of the diary writer, so that eventually we can return those diaries back to them. It's been a few months with hardly any luck at all, but I have an exciting update. Inside this package is a copy of the Cedar Rapids Gazette. I'm so excited that Grace King, a reporter there, was interested enough in this story to write an article about us. And that article led to a conversation with Todd's great-grandson. For now, let's just open up the package. I've already read the article online and I linked that on my website if you want to read it, but I definitely wanted a hard copy of it too to frame. And we made the front page, that's so exciting. And then it continues, there's so much story here. They um, actually talked to Todd's great grandson and got some of his input and his stories. And then afterwards we connected and we had a great conversation, which I'll tell you more about later. We've got a picture of the diaries here. Todd's daughter Edna from her high school yearbook. And then a photo of me. I didn't realize how big they were gonna print that. But this is definitely going to be framed. I am so excited about this. Thank you to the Cedar Rapids Gazette for writing this article and connecting me with Todd's descendants. I'm so excited to continue this journey. And I'll definitely make a video about my conversation with Todd's great-grandson very soon.